Police have a message for motorcyclists who are out and about enjoying the beautiful weather this long weekend. Be careful. Earlier this morning, a motorcyclist died following a collision in Scarborough. Police believe speed was a factor. Around 1.12 a.m. this morning, our officers responded to a personal injury collision, and this occurred on Kennedy Road, just south of Eglinton Avenue. Now, the initial reports we have is that there was a motor vehicle, and that motor vehicle was traveling southbound on Kennedy Road, making a left-hand turn onto Transway Crescent. At the same time, there was a motorcycle that was traveling northbound on Kennedy Road, and the two collided. The 39-year-old motorcycle rider was transported to hospital where he was later pronounced deceased. Early indicators is that the motorcyclist may have been traveling at a high rate of speed. According to the Ontario Provincial Police, as of July 25th, there have been 25 motorcycle fatalities in Ontario, compared to 16 to date in 2021. All deaths which occurred this year happened in clear road and weather conditions. Over the past 10 years, 50% of victims have been between 45 and 64 years old. I think that demographic is also the demographic that's really starting to enjoy the motorcycle world. Um, they have the finances and the abilities to be able to not only purchase a bike, but be able to take that day to go for a ride somewhere across the province and enjoy themselves. Toronto Police Service Constable Laura Brabant has this advice for motorcyclists. Slow down, obey the speed limits. A lot of motorcycle collisions occur due to a motorcyclist tra traveling at a high rate of speed. They just don't have the same safety features as someone um, who is operating a car. They don't have airbags. They don't have seatbelts. Um, their protection is their helmet, their gloves, and any potential body gear that they're wearing. If you are an avid rider, wear bright clothing. A lot of motorcyclists wear, you'll see them on the road with like a construction style vest on or a super bright top. It helps make them more visible. If you're intending to do lane changes, signal or indicate lane changes. You can use arm signals if you have to. Toronto Police say drivers on the road also have a responsibility. Be aware of motorcyclists around you, check your blind spots, use indicators when switching lanes, and don't follow motorcyclists too closely. Also take time getting to your destination. For City News, I'm Aliha Sheikh.